My name is Chris, and I'm an Applications Engineer for Hawker Edge Systems. Today we're going to be creating a SOLIDWORKS ID so we can access the SOLIDWORKS Customer Portal. With an active subscription and access to the Customer Portal, you can download the latest versions and service packs of SOLIDWORKS to make sure your software has all the latest fixes. To start, we'll simply go to SOLIDWORKS.com. At the top of the page here, we're going to choose Login. In the next page, simply choose SOLIDWORKS Customer Portal. And here we're asked to enter in our email address and password. And since we don't currently have a SOLIDWORKS ID, we'll go below that and choose Create SOLIDWORKS ID. You're then asked to enter in your email address and serial number. To note, there is no limit on the number of Customer Portal accounts that can be attached to a single SOLIDWORKS serial number. This means that if your company purchases any SOLIDWORKS product, all employees will have access to the customer portal by using the company serial number. So when we have our information entered, we'll choose next. And then we're asked to verify our information. If this information is incorrect, you can continue to create your customer portal account and have access to the downloads by choosing yes. What you'll want to do then is contact Hawkridge Systems Technical Support and we can create a service request with SOLIDWORKS to make sure your information is updated and correct. Once we choose next, it's going to ask us for our first and last name and our password. Once you have entered this information, again you'll choose next, and SOLIDWORKS is going to send you an email to the address that you had provided so that it can verify your account. Typically this takes five to ten minutes. Once we have everything created, we can then go back to the SOLIDWORKS Customer Portal page and choose Login. Here you'll see that you have access to the knowledge base if you have any questions or concerns or problems with the program. Down here is the download section where you have access to the downloads and updates. If you notice that you have little locks next to all of these selections, what you'll want to do is choose Register My Product. Here you'll enter in your serial number again and choose Next. It'll then ask you to verify the product that you're using. And once you have your serial number registered, you can go back and then access the Downloads and Updates page. Here you'll have access to all the latest versions of SOLIDWORKS and all the latest service packs as well. In today's video we covered how to create a SOLIDWORKS ID to access the customer portal. We then briefly took a look to see where the latest versions and service pack downloads can be accessed. Thanks for watching.